Hey, it's Matthew, and I was thinking about the, the benefits of having a quiet mind the other day. I was uh, writing some gratitudes to one of my clients, and I just thought about, you know, the, the power of the quiet mind is so amazing because uh, today I don't get ruffled by anything. You know, life is uncertain. It's going up and down, and, and things are coming at you, and, um, you know, what, bad stuff happens, but um, when your mind is quiet, you're in this resourceful state. You're in this state of um, peace and flow and just, you know, like nothing, nothing takes you off track. And, and I'm just so, um, I'm just so grateful to have been experiencing that. And I just love teaching other people how to experience the same thing. The other thing that I, I was thinking about was systems, you know, um, I really, I, I was trained by my father who is a real estate sales coach and his whole thing was system, 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 systems. And you know, the systems have really been just like a, an incredible benefit to me because I've systemized pretty much everything in my life and the more I systemize, the more I reduce the uncertainty. You know, you can't eliminate it, but you reduce the uncertainty and then on top of it, um, because I have this non-reactive, non-emotional um, non way of operating because of the quiet mind, I've got this uh, a higher level of certainty from the systems plus the non-reactivity. It creates this opening for all kinds of creativity. So my ability to assess the situation and come up with something new and interesting and different that produces much greater results than, than what other people could produce. Or um, suddenly I have like a quantum leap that was not even expected. You didn't even think that that quantum leap could even come. Uh, all that happens because one, I, and my mind is quiet, it's not antagonizing me. And then two, I have created systems around me so that my life works in a very flowing and effective way and opens me up to more creativity and resourcefulness. So I really recommend that you spend time, one, working on getting your mind into a super quiet place, and then two, working on the, you know, just the tactical, pragmatic aspects of life where you systemize, automate, create workflow everywhere in your life. Re really work on your disciplines so that you reduce the amount of thinking about the basics and you maximize the amount of free time, the mind share that you have for thinking creatively.